all a minute to let your eyes adjust to my colors. I am aware that I look like Miss Frizzle's fat fraternal twin. <laughs> Getting ready to drunk drive the magic Dodge Caravan to Wapakoza. <laughs> We're gonna learn things. Okay, class, here's something I want more information about. Why do dudes feel the need to, like, rub their dick all over me after they've unleashed their liquid love demon? You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> It's like they're spooning pureed squash off a baby's chin. It's just weird as all. Mm -hmm. Like, is it an instinct or is it something you learned from porn? I'm just curious. I guess the closest I come to understanding that impulse is after I pump a full tank of gas. Mm -hmm. I rub the nozzle all over the outside of the gas hole. Just to get all the little drops out. But that's just to get the most of what I'm paying for. You know? As soon as your dick nectar becomes a tradable commodity, I might have a little more respect for your process. As long as we've got the incognito browser up. Uh, can we not tap on my crotch like we're searching for a vein? Does anybody else get that? Yeah, yeah, ask first. I'm not into it. If you meet one of those unicorn ladies who is into that, uh, she'll let you know. She'll, hey, um, could you just like, like you're giving CPR to a mouse? If you're taking all of your advice from phlebotomists, I suggest precision. Or a tourniquet. You know what's not a tourniquet, though? Condoms, you whiners. I don't love them either. It's like fucking a balloon animal. But I don't know where you've been. I know where I'm going, and that's certainly not to a Toys R Us. And I don't trust guys who pull out, right? Because if you have the ability to interrupt one of the most primal experiences you can have as a human being, just to bust on my snack pouch, there is a 100% chance you're gonna pull out emotionally as well. <laughs> you guys. There are so many condoms. They come in so many fun flavors and styles and chemicals. <laughs> Do you guys ever notice though that like Magnum condoms don't come in any fun styles? That's because the big dick is the fun part. <laughs> and I don't need Magnum fire and ice condoms. You tearing me in half burns quite enough, thanks. <laughs> Warm it up is all. I'm not a leftover pizza. Sex is not supposed to be uncomfortable until I see your face the next morning. Do you guys know that 35% of men are wearing condoms that are too large? 35%, yeah. So apparently the average man pays just enough attention to women's fashion to understand that wearing something a little baggy can make you appear larger. <laughs> but it's a public health concern. If I have to fish one more condom out of my snatch, <laughs> I'm gonna fucking kill somebody. I will say it is just a little bit sweet though that you guys are dressing for the job you want instead of the job you want. <laughs> and Nina, thank you.